What's up guys? This is Kiwi Art and welcome to another tutorial on Photoshop. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how I had made the effect that you have seen in the video thumbnail or in the video introduction using this image using Photoshop. And to do this, I'm using a very high resolution image. And first step, we have to make a duplicate layer from the background layer. I'm making a duplicate layer and let us just give it a name something like model and okay okay now I'm selecting the model layer and I'm gonna make some adjustment with this model layer so I'm going to image menu from here and selecting the adjustment menu and in here you can see there are many more adjustment option something like brightness contrast level colors exposure vibrance hue saturation color balance color lookup etc but what I'm gonna choose is threshold so I'm selecting threshold and you can see what happened with this image so adjusting the threshold level we can obtain the black color for the or shadows we need i have selected 80 but it can be anything depending on the images lighting images color etc so now what i'm going to do next is to select the brush tool and work with it and before working with brush tool i'm going to make a new layer and its name is layer 1 and I'm going to select the brush that I will use and I have selected drills brush and <clears throat> you can see I have a set of watercolor brush and you can download it I have given the link in the description so <clears throat> let's go with this and make the brush bigger bigger and bigger i'm putting the brush in the in this position and i'm going to make a stroke here here you go and you can see I have made the stroke here now I'm gonna select the layer 1 and uh, use the magic wand tool and select the area of the brush stroke and you can see the area of brush stroke has selected so now what I'm gonna do next is to make clipping mask and before masking we should keep in mind that the layer that should be masked will be under the selection layer here you can see the layer one is containing selection and I'm gonna make mask on model layer so I will keep it under the selecting layer and the selecting layer should be up to the model layer that should be masked and I'm selecting model layer and clicking on add layer mask and you can see I have masked the area that I have selected now I'm simply hide the background layer and we have almost obtained what we need but you can see the edge of this layer is a little bit rough and we don't need this roughness so to remove this I'm gonna simply hide the layer one and uh, the effect that we need is almost obtained now to give it a nice look I'm gonna make some color combination here and uh, to do this I'm gonna make a new layer and before making new layer I'm gonna delete the background layer because we don't need it anymore and I'm making the new layer and this name is layer 2 and I'm gonna fill this layer with the color and 
Now I'm gonna use the brush tool in the model layer. And uh, I'm select, uh, I've selected the brush tool and uh, in here I'm, I'm using very basic brush of Photoshop. And before making stroke, keep in mind that you have selected this side of this layer and also unlink the mask from here. So I'm gonna make a stroke here and before making stroke, I'm gonna make the opposite a little bit down and it's 57 percent I have used and here you go. Now you can see the color is not balanced. So to make balance, I'm using I drop a tool and selecting the color and again I'm dropping the color on layer 2 and here you go. The effect we need is obtained and it can be done with any photograph you want with a good lighting, good color color balanced photograph and uh, that's all for today and if you like my video don't forget to subscribe my channel for more tutorial and if you like this don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also share to spread the learning so thank you and also check out the other video you're watching right now on the screen thank you